the bittersweet science of nostalgia, how memory matures with emotion. We've all felt it, that sudden wave of warmth when a song, a smell, or an old photo transports us back. Nostalgia. It's often described as a joy tinged with sadness, but a new study suggests it's more than that. It's an emotional journey that evolves over time. Researchers explored how our feelings toward nostalgic memories shift from the moment they're made to the moment we look back on them. What they found challenges the traditional idea that memory's emotional tone is fixed. Unlike ordinary memories, nostalgic ones begin rich with positive emotions, comfort, connection, and joy. But as time passes, those memories don't just fade, they become more emotionally complex. The warmth lingers, but it's joined by feelings like regret and loneliness. In two experiments, people were asked to recall nostalgic, neutral, or ordinary events and rate their emotional responses to those memories, both how they felt at the time of the event and how they felt recalling it later. The nostalgic memory shifted and positive feelings softened. Regret and loneliness crept in, but interestingly, so did gratitude. That bittersweet blend may be what makes nostalgia so uniquely powerful. Even as the past becomes more layered, more human, the psychological benefits remain. Nostalgia still boosts self-esteem, feelings of connection, and meaning in life. But those benefits hinge on how positive the memory feels when we revisit it. That means the way we reflect matters. These findings don't just help us understand why nostalgia pulls at our hearts. They also offer a potential tool for therapy and well-being. Reflection, it turns out, isn't always rosy. But when done right, it can be profound. Because nostalgia doesn't just help us remember who we were. It helps us understand who we are now. This video is based on the research paper, Remembrance of Things Past, Temporal Change in the Effective Signature of Nostalgic Events, by Tim Wildschut et al. in Cognition and Emotion. What do you think about this study? Drop us a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.